if you work in tech or already wants to get into tech you surely come across the term api today we are going to take a deep dive into what an api is and why we need them let's start with the basics what is an api an api stands for application programming interface but to really understand this let us break it down into smaller chunks Application is any software that solves a specific problem or provides a unique functionality. If you take your phone, you could find numerous applications such as WhatsApp, Zoom, and many more. Each of these applications has a special functionality. Programming, on the other hand, is the process or the language that tells the software how to work. The interface is also the protocol that defines how different applications talk to each other through a request and a response, commonly known as a request-response cycle. In simple terms, an API is a way for applications or systems to communicate with each other. It is just like having a universal translator between two different pieces of software. Alright, theoretically this sounds cool, but why do we need an API? So without API, our software would look like an isolated island, unable to share data or work together. APIs connect these isolated islands together and let our application and systems work seamlessly together. Now let's tighten things up. Imagine you are at your favorite pizza joint. The menu is just like the API documentation. It lists out all the options you have. You call out your order, that's your request, and the chef takes note of your order and makes it for you. That's your response. This whole process is known as the request response cycle. Just like ordering pizza, APIs let software applications order and receive data or services exactly as needed. Now we have laid the groundwork, let us see an API in action. Here is a quick look at how a weather API will work. Weather.com provides an API that an application could use to check the current weather of any location at a particular given time. Let's say that we are building a weather tracking app and we want our users to check for weather of a particular place. In the application, we send a request to get the current weather for a specific location and the API responds with the data. It is just like asking for a pizza and getting it delivered right to your doorstep. As you can see, the app sends a request and the API returns the data needed just like ordering a pizza at your favorite pizza joint. To sum it all up, APIs are like the secret messengers that allow different applications to talk to each other. They help keep our digital world connected, just like a friendly waiter who takes your pizza order exactly as you want. Thanks for watching today. If you enjoyed this deep dive into APIs, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech insights. See you in the next one.